Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I'm sure the audio is fine right now. I just need to plug my microphone in properly. But Love Island has revealed their cast for the summer 2024 season. So let's see what's popping. Guys, I really wanna know everything that you guys think in the comment section below. They dropped, I think they started dropping pictures on their Instagram page from like 7 a.m. or something ridiculous like that. And then they've also posted a video on TikTok. So I'm also gonna to react to that because I think there's one thing to see people in motion and then there's one thing to show, show someone in pictures and you guys know love island photographers always or not always most of the time do the contestants dirty so guys before i get into this video please don't forget to like comment and subscribe you already know road to 20k Alrighty, guys so i'm just gonna go on the instagram page and we're gonna start from the one they dropped first okay um miss samantha now Miss Samantha looks grown, and I mean grown as in she definitely, and this is not an insult guys, I'm just, this is just straight commentary, so please, 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 this is not shade, um, because we all, we all need to grow up and we're all gonna grow up, but yeah, she definitely looks like she's in her late 20s, and I definitely know she's not in her 30s, because they wouldn't, I don't think they would let someone in their 30s come on the show, but anyways, so she looks like she's in her late 20s um she's scouse which will be quite interesting because that scouse accent right there oh <laughs> honestly then i think hannah wasn't hannah from love island was it love island? no love island games what was um, all star she was from liverpool so they will be quite interested to hear another scouse accent on on tv um her little bio says samantha's scouse glamour has arrived on the island next stop bag of cockney charmer she can bring back to Liverpool. So that's what it says. Um, I think ultimately she looks pretty. She has nice teeth. She has an amazing body. Going on her Instagram page because thankfully they've linked it. She does makeup. Now I'm not gonna lie, baby does really, really good makeup. Baby does really, really good makeup. But the guy, I think the girl is pretty, but let me see her emotion first. But at the moment, I think Samantha is pretty. I think she's definitely somebody that would be on Love Island. Um, she looks like the type. So now moving on, we have Monveer, and I'm hopefully I'm saying his name right, but he is of South Asian descent. Now, please correct me if I'm wrong, but I think this is the first time Love Island's ever started off with a South Asian Islander. Because I know we had Priya from a couple years ago, but she was a bombshell, she was really boring, but he is um, starting off and it says that he's a Valentine's Day baby and he hopes that Cupid's arrow will bless him in the villa. Okay, let's see. I'm not gonna lie, is the pose given? Absolutely not. Um, uh, I, I'm, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not gonna lie, I'm, I'm not too keen on, on, the, on the pose. Uh, I don't think other people in the comment section are keen on the pose because why are people saying that he is giving a mixture of uh, Mehdi and Sammy, but um, yeah. Now, I really hope he's not a Mehdi 2.0 because no, none of them girls even need that type of stress. I don't need that type of stress on my TV screen. So let's just hope he's just being playful with this pose. Um, but we shall see. Now, going to his Instagram page, uh, this man's good looking. So let's just hope, like Mehdi, he's not doing up catfish. Because Mehdi, mm, I remember seeing that picture of Mehdi, in a, there was a picture of Mehdi in the car. I was like, that could, mm, I would jump that. Mehdi in real life, oh God in heaven, Jesus Christ, give me strength. And again, it's not that he's not attractive, it's just that he's not the man in the picture. Because you know? the man in the picture was just giving, Arr. um, and Mehdi wasn't giving that. So yeah, let me just be honest, that, that was just what the fact of the matter is. But um, yeah, this guy is good looking as long as this is what he looks like in real life. So we shall see, but I feel like he's gonna be someone that's gonna be funny, he's gonna be good vibes to the villa, so we shall see. But let's see who's gonna be interested in him and who he's gonna be interested in. Okay, the next girl's called Nicole. Now I'm not really not fond of her because why she got my name? Why have we got the same name? Now I gotta be saying my name. I hate when I know people that got my same name, like, oh, I'm the only Nicole, hello? Hello? Anyway, so Nicole is a Welsh pocket rock. Oh, oh, I literally hate that. Like, pocket rocket. That's so, like, it's just so not me. But anyways, she's um, a Welsh pocket rocket looking to score a rugby boy who will be happy in the valleys. Oh, not in the valleys. I used to watch a show called The Valleys. I don't know if you guys ever watched it, but mm, the acting is also quite interesting. Um, So she actually kind of looks like, I don't know if you guys ever watched... Um, the only way is Essex. She kind of reminds me of Lauren, is it Gujar? She kind of looks like Lauren Gujar. Um, again, looks like someone that would be on Love Island, but again, 
similar com com um, commentary to Samantha that I spoke about the first girl. Why she look really grown? I don't know if it's what they really look like. If it's the photography, I don't know if it's Botox because I know that these girls got Botox now. We're not gonna, we're not gonna, we're not, we're not gonna, we're gonna be adults now. We're gonna not play with each other. But um, I just hate the fact that a lot of women do this type of thing because it really, really does age you and actually strips away your youth. I know some people have definitely said something about like um, getting Botox as a preventative me measure. I don't even think that really makes sense because if you just look young, young then you look young. But I think whatever she's doing, I would like her to stop doing it because watch her not even be. Watch her be like 26 and looks older than that. Just watch that be the case. So, um, but again, maybe she'll look different in motion, but we shall see. Going on her Instagram page, let me see what she's saying on her Instagram. On her Instagram page, oh, she's giving baddie, but then again, it's giving edited. So let's see, because sometimes I can't even see a crease underneath these girls' eyes, and I know there's creases there, but... Um, she looks cute. She looks cute. I think she looks pretty. She definitely looks like a Love Island girl. Um, let's just have, see how she's in motion. But I think, depending on what guys are here, she will enjoy. She'll have a good time here. Moving on. Now we see Ronnie. We have Ronnie. Okay, Ronnie. He's about says Ronnie is sidelining his football career to focus on a new goal. Score his future wife. Um, what team does he play for? Because man, you just won the FA Cup, period, period. Um, but yeah, so what team does he play for? Because this football stuff, because we're not in football. He's not, he's not giving football, I'm not going to lie. I'm looking at him and I'm not getting football, but such is life. Now, to talk about Ronnie, I guess, I think he looks tall, so that's a good thing. He got a head full of hair. He's not giving transplant, and even if it was, oh well. Um, yeah, I, get, I think a lot of girls would like this guy. Not my papa. But a lot of girls, especially the two girls that we've just seen, yeah, I can see him enjoying himself and I can see girls enjoying him for sure. Um, he, I, I, I'm hoping he's older, as in like in his late 20s, just because those other two girls look like they're in their late 20s. So it was, I always think it's nice to like, when they bring in older girls, please bring in the older guys that can match up to it instead of bringing up in these 21 year olds that, like a 21 year old ain't dating no 28 year old woman. And, I when mean, I mean that, I don't mean the guy's not dating the girl. I mean, I don't understand why a big woman at 28 would want to date a 21 year old guy. I know it's legal, but everything that's legal makes sense. So he looks older. I'm hoping he's older. Um, yeah, that's 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 what that's that's what I'm hoping for. Um, going on his page, he seems to okay. I, you know, I can't tell what team he plays for, but he plays for a team. Um, they got a kit. Um, he scored a goal, so that's always good. It seems like he's best friends or friends of, um, so Olivia Atwood from season three, she got married and I guess wh whoever her man is, they're friends because I can see wedding photos, which is really, really cute. Um, yeah, he kind of looks, he looks like a geezer. I'm not gonna lie, he looks like a geezer, so I feel like the girls might like him. Um... Even looking at him in like Ibiza or Marbella, it, 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 really, it literally makes sense. Like a lot of these people could really just be on their own where's Essex and everything would make sense. Um, so that's that. Moving on, we have Patsy. I even hate her name for her. Um, Patsy is like 60, 64 years old and is sitting in front of the TV watching Coronation Street. That's what Patsy's giving me, but uh, this Patsy is not giving me that, but her parents. So Patsy's um, thing says, or caption says, Patsy's been picky, but now it's time to find her man. If you're tall, dark and handsome, form an orderly queue. So Ronnie seems to be like someone that she would like. Um, I wonder why she's picky. Um, why does it look like the tattoo she has on her arm? What is that? Is it Snoopy? I don't know what I, I thought it was the bad girls club uh, symbol. I actually have no clue what that is. But um, so Patsy's there. I know some people in the comment section um, of the first girl were like, oh, we need some different body types. And I'm not saying Patsy's a different body type now, but uh, she definitely thicker than the other two. So if people want a bit more diversity, I guess that is. But then again, she's really not plus size. So is she really diverse? Probably not, if I'm if I'm gonna be frank. Um to me, she looks like you know the twins from last season? 
she looks like one of them or a mixture of both of them just with darker hair or red hair or whatever color brown hair she has um so there's a lot of copy and paste there's a lot of synergy in the in the, in the cast for sure um I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Um, I'm not, well, I think she's, she's, she's cute. I think going on her page, she looks younger on her page than she does for the photographer taking pictures. So now that I'm saying, I don't know if it's the photographers doing them dirty or if this is what they really look like. I think she definitely looks way better on her Instagram, but then also there's grounds for her to edit it. She looks way younger in her Instagram photos. I don't know, I don't know. This girl's throwing me off because she doesn't even look like she got a bit of, like, because I remember I said she, had, she looks like bigger than the other two. Uh, not on her Instagram. Not on her Instagram. She looks tiny on her. So again, I don't know if it's the photos. I don't know. But guys, you're going to have to see because there's a lot of difference between the photographer's photos and the IG photos. So time will tell, guys. Time will tell. But I, honestly, the girls don't even look the same. I would say this Patsy and the other Patsy on her Instagram, I would almost say that's not the same girl. So we shall see because it's giving catfish or I don't know. Some stuff, stuff is happening and I'm not quite understanding it. So moving on, we have a guy called Kieran. Um, I think this is the first guy I saw. I'm not like the picture that like, I saw of him. I think he looked better looking in that picture that I saw. But then again, we always have to caveat it. Love Island producers, uh, photographer, make them look not as great sometimes so yeah kieran he's caption says kieran will be using his height humor and welsh charm um to find his to find his what in, I, i'm assuming this is a welsh slang so i'm just gonna skip it um in the villa so basically looking for his girl in the villa um where's the people from london i'm sorry let me just do a sidetrack i'm sorry everyday welsh uh liverpool uh wherever else i'm sorry where are the people from london i'm sorry i know this has got nothing to do with opacity in china but like sometimes i need to hear my own voice on tv sometimes i need to hear my own i need to get my own via from the tv screen and we brought six people in and there's no one from london or no one that i know that's from london so we shall see but anyways going back to kieran he does look tall um He's got dark features, so I feel like so when people was like tall, dark, and handsome, um, this is what they mean when those type of girls say it. Um, he look high, he look, he look high. Um, he look high. Um, I don't have too much commentary, but why is he taking my last name? I don't know. Why is his name last name Davis? I don't know. Um, I definitely think okay. So he plays rugby. So one of the girls that said that she likes a rugby player they got the athletic guys so yeah you know I mean? they're playing in the stadium they got people in the crowd so it looks legit guys come on it looks legit um let me see his pictures i think yeah i think the, I get, he looks young though the man looks like 23 maybe he looks quite young but i think the girls will like him he's quite he's quite in the pictures at least he looks bigger um i think girls will find, i think girls will find him cute i think i definitely think uh I think girls will find him cute. I think, I definitely think so. Let's just hope he's of age and he acts the part, but at the same time, he looks a bit boring. You see, guys, this is the picture I've seen in him. Now, in this picture, I don't know if y'all can see it. That picture, oh, yeah, he was giving it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If he looks at that picture, oh, yeah, he, 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 he gonna shut this down. But again, he don't look like that in the Love Island picture. So, uh, we got a theme. Now, guys, let's move on, let's move on, let's move on, let's get to Mimi. With two eyes. Mm. She a baddie, she knows she a 10. Don't play with it, don't play with it. Come on, baby, don't play with it. When I saw Mimi, I said, yeah. All right, then. All right, all right, all right. I, you know that, like, I'm sorry. Mm, I already know who I'm voting for. I already know who I'm, like, I already know who I'm taping for. I already know this girl's gonna be 10, 10. I'm not even gonna, I'm, I'm getting 10, 10. First of all, why is she one of the only people that looks bad in her photo? I mean, when I say bad as in bad, good in her photo, so, okay? Okay, now I don't know if the producers, um, not the producers, the photographers had something against the rest of them, but she, like, I'm sorry, oh, you know what, it's not even the photographers. She's just too 10-10 that the photographers could not have messed up her pictures. I'm sorry, that's the impression I'm getting because look at the smile, look at the teeth, look at the body, look at the bust out, like, she's beautiful, look at the skin's glowing. Mimi, yeah, baby, it's, give, it's giving baby. That's what it's giving, guys. Let's let's be frank. Let's be honest. Um, let's shame the devil. It's giving bad me. So I'm excited about Mimi because I feel like every season needs at least one black gal, and I'm saying at least one. If you have more, please give us more. But I'm um, loving what she's looking like already. 
Mimi's caption says, Mimi is wifey material, but will her future hubby be behind the villa doors? Yeah, I'm liking her and it seems like loads of picture, loads of people in the comment section are liking her. A lot of people are commenting as well that <clears throat> the promo pictures, yeah, they didn't catch her. The cars of the, of the promo pictures did not catch her. This baby is eating it up, period, point blank. Ooh, yeah, it makes sense. Now let's look at her Instagram page. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm liking the fashion. I'm liking the style. Yeah, she's a beautiful girl. And she, the thing is, she still looks bad in her own photos. Like, she's, I need, I need to stop saying bad. Y'all know when I say bad, I mean good. But yeah, she still looks like really, really good in her, on her IG photos, even with her and her makeup on. Yeah, she's a baddie. So, um, I'm just praying, guys. No, 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 guys, no, no. Let's all, no, no, let's all hold hands quickly. Okay. Say with me. Mimi will have a good season of Love Island this year. Baby will have options. Baby will not be picked last. Baby will be desired. We don't gonna hear men say blonde hair and blue eyes. To be fair, actually, I haven't seen a girl with blonde hair and blue eyes yet. But still, yes. Father Lord, yes. Yeah? Baby's not gonna be play with. Yeah? She's not gonna be typecasting. People like, mmm. She gonna, she gonna win. She gonna have a great personality. People ain't gonna play with her. Yeah. That's what we're praying for. She gonna, whatever she wants, she gonna get. That's what we're hoping for, okay? Yeah, okay. So Mimi, we like Mimi. Um, let's see who Mimi likes and who likes Mimi. So I'm curious to see about that. Now, the next guy, Sam. Um, the picture ain't great. The picture is not great. He looks quite stocky. There's nothing wrong with stocky, but he looks quite stocky to me. Zooming in. I think he, he has a, he has, looks like he looks like he's got a cheeky smile. He got a nose piercing, which I really, really hate. Y'all know I hate nose piercings, but it is what it is. Um, the tattoos, I quite like, I, to be fair, I don't even think I've really ever dated someone that has tattoos, but the tattoos, I, you know what I mean? They're calm, they're calm, they're calm. He looks like he would be a good time just from the smile. The smile is telling me he gonna be fun. His caption says, Sam is bringing proper um, personality and cheeky, and cheeky chat to raise heads and heart rates. On the, on the island um yeah i think yeah he, he he looks decent he looks decent let's go on his page now okay now on his page he look better um now he got a mullet let me just mm. why is mullets coming back guys i don't understand why mullets are coming back but mullets apparently apparently are coming back so they're coming back so they're back hello um he looks a lot better um is he a hairstylist? Oh. Mm. Um. Guys, this one is a hairstylist. Ha. Huh? I I don't think I've seen. I'm just guys. I'm about to be ignorant. I'm just gonna say I don't think I've seen a man that looks like him. That's straight, that does hair. I'm not even gonna lie. I know that sounds ignorant, but I'm gonna have to say it. Because if, if you guys see something different, let me know. But he does hair. Okay, so this one's interesting. This one right here, he said, Pew, fast man in the world. This one's interesting. Because he does hair, men and women. He got tattoos, and like, he doesn't look like what he's supposed to. Like, you know, guys, you know, when someone doesn't look like what they do, like, do I look like a lawyer, guys? I hope so. Anyways, um, but he, well, I'm very, very, very intrigued about this guy now that I know that he does hair and he looks the way he looks because this is very much so given Don't Judge a Book by his cover. But um, on his IG, he's good looking, and I'm just, in, I'm, I'm just intrigued to hear about this whole career thing. I'm very, very intrigued. I'm very, very intrigued. And as of right now. I want him and Mimi to get together, but let's let me see who else is left. Let me see. Who, but at my man, them two are they, they're giving a very very beautiful couple at the moment. The next one, Jess. Now let me just start off. Don't just look like Patsy, the girl I just the, one of the girls I just spoke about. If I'm not mistaken, they really say copy and paste in the same season. When I say copy and paste, I meant from previous seasons. They say copy and paste in the same season. Okay, but let me give let me give let me let me give Jess a chance. The caption says, Jess is hoping to bag herself a babe that can keep her and her but with her bubbly, bubbly and bold personality. Um, again, respectfully, 
Why do these girls look so seasoned? I don't know if it's the photo or it's the Botox, because again, I wouldn't be surprised if this one had Botox as well, but I don't understand. Um, I don't, I don't understand. I don't understand. I don't understand. Like, I don't understand. Um, she's got a nice body, but I don't get it. I don't really get it. Um, looking at her page, let me see. She looks quite cute on her, on her page though. She looks quite wholesome on her page. Um, she looks quite sweet in her page. Why well, I keep on saying in her page? On her page. Um, and she doesn't look as old. So let's see, let's see, let's see. Then maybe it's just bad photos. But again, I can't keep on mentioning that. Like this girl in, in the Love Island and the promo photo doesn't even look like the girl in her, on her Instagram. So let's see which one we get in real life. Okay, moving on. We have Ayo. Hmm. Let me see. I think he looks really cute. He looks very young. He looks like he's like 23, but he looks very cute. And I feel like he's going to be funny. I don't know. I don't know. So it's, his caption says, Ayo is um, tired of being outside and is ready to cuddle up in the villa. So that means if he was not in the villa at the moment, he would have been at Reese's, but we shall see. But again, as we always get, we get one black girl and one black guy. Let's see what is going to happen. Um, I do like what he looks like. Um, let me see his page. Let me see his page. Um, okay, so he does a little bit of modeling. He got good skin. He also plays football. He plays for what? E Essex County. Okay, so maybe he this was from London because he might be nearby. I'm not gonna I think I like the way this guy's looking. I'm not gonna lie, I like the way he's looking. And he, you know what I mean? I like I like the way he's looking. Now I know a lot of people are gonna be thinking, okay, are there is our Mimi or is Mimi and him gonna be put together because they're they're the only blacks in the villa? Um, we sh again, if, if that's what they want, then that's what, then we need to go with what they want. If that's not what they want, then, then we have to go for that as well. So I think people, we need to be open-minded and hopefully other people are open-minded, but again, if that's how, if, if that's how they want it to be, then that's how they want it to be. Um, but yeah, I just want them both to, more so Mimi, because again, it's the black girls that don't have options. So we know, you know, we know what it is, but yeah, I like his smile. I think he will be a great character. Um, so yeah, we... We shall see. We shall see. The next girl is Harriet. Again, again, if I say these girls look old one more effing time, I'm actually tired of saying it. I'm actually tired of saying it because why she looks so grown? And I'm saying late twenties as a as a compliment. You know, I'm not trying to do too much, and I'm not trying to do too much because it's not about doing too much. It's just that these pictures just are just terrible. Honestly, in terms of like, she looks like she's a pretty girl or pretty woman. Let me say that. Um, I hate the flowers on her bikini, on her swimsuit. I really do hate it. She got really, really nice teeth. Hair's nice, but I just think, let me, let me, you know, let me carry on. Okay, the caption says Harriet's got a, sp a special spark um, that will light up the villa, but which way will sh will shine for her? So that's that. Again, a lot of people in the comment section are saying it's giving control, it's giving um, copy and paste. Some people are saying that she really has a boyfriend. How? Huh? Um, okay, I don't know if she has a boyfriend or not, but let me go on her page. Okay, so I would say she's definitely probably an influencer because she already started, I think, well, I'm clicking on her page today, or right now, and she has 36,000 uh, followers, so she must be some sort of influencer or something, and looking at her page, she definitely looks like it. Again, another girl that would be on, that would fit into Taui so easily. Um, to be fair, I'm not gonna lie, I think she still does look, um watch her be young and look as old as she looks and, and, and again i don't even i'm not even trying to be nasty i don't even want to be nasty but i'm and <laughs> i gotta call a spade a spade but um let's hope she's got a bit more to her than what she looks like let's let's just hope that's the case to be fair i'm not even gonna actually you know what let me not talk too much let me let me let me move on because let's 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 let's, let's be let's be nice let's be friends um the next guy and the last guy thankfully is a guy called sean now like, sean looks Young and shortish. Looks like a short king, but we shall see. I don't know. Um, Sean's smile is stand is stand out, and he's looking for a cracking karaoke partner that will steal the show. Um, yeah, he just looks. You know what I mean? He, he's there. Um, he's there. I think he'll be funny. I think he'll be the, like a nice guy. 
yeah, I, I'm not really getting too much out of him. And even looking at his pictures, he's definitely giving me like 22, just got out of uni. Look, he went to Thailand, so he's almost like, oh, I finished uni, so let's go to Thailand. And da -da -da -da. again, I could be wrong, but that's what it's giving. At the moment, because all the women look so grown, I don't know who's gonna go for this one because he looks quite little. Um, as in in age, not in height. So, yeah. Um, guys, that's the cast. That is the cast of Love Island. So, we don't have any, it doesn't seem appear that we have any blonde women. So, anyone has, any guy that wants to say, I like blonde hair and blue eyes, there's nobody there for you at the moment. But I'm sure they will be on their way. We don't have any light skinned square heads. That's also something different because we usually have our light skinned square heads. We only have two black people, which is part of the course. I guess we have a South Asian guy. So, I get that's something. So we have three, three out of 12 is diverse. Them odds are not great. I'll be so serious. Them odds are not great. But then again, we have the exact same complaint every single season for Love Island. So let's keep it a bark. Um, most of them look like they're going to be here to grow their influencing career, which is, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm actually okay with it because we need to understand that guys, gone are the days that people came onto a show just to have something interesting happen in their life. Not that life was boring, but I'm saying like, just to have something different. Gone are the days where people just came for the experience itself. Um, gone are the days of, you know what I mean, early Love Island, before the show really picked up, people were really showing their real color, their true colors. People were really, who you saw was who, the, who they were, outrageous or not. Yeah, gone the days of early Big Brother, like it's them days are gone. So I think I'm not even gonna complain about most of them looking a certain type of way because that's what sells and that's the day and age we live in right now. So overall, do I love the cast? No. Um, overall, is the cast okay? Yeah, they're okay. I think, um, yeah, they're cool. I don't think it's always indicative of how a show is gonna be based on the looks of the first cast or the, the, the intro people. So, I'm still hopeful because it's Love Island and I definitely think Love Island last season was really, really good. Really, really good. We had really, really great... We need a Tyreek, I'm not gonna lie. Even though Tyreek irritate me, we need a Tyreek. And I think the diversity from last season, we definitely don't have it. Because last season, if I think about it, we had Tyreek, we had Ella, Whitney was a, like a bombshell, the day one bombshell thing. Um, we had Catherine, we had... What was that little Asian girl called? Oh, I can't remember what her name was, but... She, we had her, like we had, we had some, we had a decent amount um, on day one. Um, did, we have, did we have any black guys on day one? I can't even remember. But we had, we had like it was decent last season. So not, it's not that great this season, but we shall see. Again, we have bombshells. People are going to be coming in, coming out. So yeah, let's see. Um, let's see what's good. Now let's actually look at the videos in motion. So let's really see our people's face matching up to their pictures. Let's 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 see. Let me see if my commentary is still the same. So let's look. Okay, so Sam's cute. Period. Sam's cute, period. I still want him with Mimi because Sam is cute. Yeah, Mimi's still it. So next, Mimi's still it next, baby girl next. Yeah, I'm not like Kieran look way better in his pictures. Oh lordy. Like on his Instagram, but I think you know he looks like a nice guy. He looks like a nice a nice lad. So we shall see. Yeah, Nicole does look like what I said she does look like. It, it is what it is. Yeah, she got a nice body, I guess. Yeah. One veer. He's okay. He, yeah, I think I think so. I think he got one on brow, but I think I think fundamentally he looks the same. Yeah, Patsy looks like her pictures in terms of, she looks like the Love Island picture. Yeah, Sean looks the same. He looks the same. Samantha, she looks how I described her. Um, yeah, Ronnie looks, yeah, the girls will like Ronnie. The girls will like Ronnie. Jess, Jess looks like her. I, only, I feel like Ayo looks so cute, honestly. I love his smile. I just love his smile. Harrier, oh Lord have mercy. Jesus give us strength. Guys, this is gonna be a long shot season. Whew. The bombshells need to boom, bam, boom, bam, beam. Are you guys understanding me? The bombshells need to go boom, 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 bam, beam. There's probably, I need to probably download the app because there's probably some sort of voting that we need to do. And again, I need to make sure I protect my girl Mimi. I wanna protect Ayo. I wanna protect Sam at this point. Who else? I don't know, those are my top three at the moment. 
TBC. Things can change. You know, y'all know things can change anytime. I definitely think Love Island is going to start either next. I think it's going to probably start next week, Monday, I assume. Um, because it usually starts the first week of June. So we shall see. But guys, please let me know what you think of these Islanders. Is the cast giving? Is it not? Who are you rooting for? Who are you not rooting for? What rumors have you already heard? <laughs> What's the tea? What's going on? But guys, thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.